Hello and welcome to Working Brick. Today's video starts out a bit different. I guess, uh, what is this? You might, uh, right now be saying that I've already done an air launch because this looks like an aircraft. But no, it's a very poor attempt at a, cron at a, a chronoclon. Sorry for mispronunciations. But yes, it's a ground effect vehicle that uh, flies based on the interactions between air and the ground, which amplifies lift. It's way more complicated than that. Basically, there's a Kerbal Space Program mod called Ground Effect, which adds Ground Effect to Kerbal Space Program. And so, I uh, tried to build a Chronoplan, a, a famous example of a Ground Effect vehicle, and launch a rocket from it. Now, okay, so this Chronoplan, um, I may, I have to admit, I'm unsure if it actually has to use Ground Effect. But, uh, well, we can uh, forget about the uh, technicalities of the uh, launch, because what we're doing the launch right now, and, um, that was, uh, that was certainly something, wasn't, wasn't it? It's like my uh, spin launch video that was uploaded last week, which, uh, fun fact, I did the commentary, f commentary for that just a few minutes ago. I'm uploading, I'm well, recording these on the, si on the same day, and yes, it's the same rocket, uh, I designed this, uh, just be a small uh, vehicle I could use for my uh, various uh, launch system tests. And so from here on up, it's a pretty standard launch. Main focus was the uh, launch my uh, chronoplan, which, uh, so you might have heard that the chronoplan just kind of crashed into the ocean, but it was able to fly on its own. And so theoretically it could have uh, flown back to uh, back to Kerbal Space Center, and uh, the crew survived anyways. And so we can uh, get this uh, satellite to orbit, and sure and get a high eccentricity to orbit, because uh, I again have a, uh, a realism overhaul science experiment on this. Uh, if you want more information about that, uh, check back at the previous video. So yeah, we can uh, run that and start collecting some cosmic ray data. Yeah, this was just a, a demonstration of a interesting uh, launch system that uh, definitely is not practical, but it's just incredibly cool. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe, and goodbye!